Hello. We now turn to the question, what does it mean to be an engineer in France? This question is a fascinating one because through French history and especially the history of engineers in France, one can understand a great deal about what counts as significant or important in the world today, especially in Europe and in former European colonies. France has been a veritable fountain of interesting ideas. As a first step in understanding the relevance of engineers in France, consider Bastille Day in Paris. On the 14th of July in 1789, commoners stormed the Bastille, which was a royal fortress in Paris, and they wrested power from the king, formally initiating what later became known as the French Revolution. Perhaps you are aware of the enormous military parade that takes place in Paris each year to commemorate the events that led to establishment of the first French Republic. But did you know that each year this parade is led by engineering students? More per precisely, the parade is led by second year students from the Ecole Polytechnique, which is the most elite institution of higher education in France. These days, not all of the students are engineers in training, but the bulk of them still are. At the key moment, on the key day, when the entire nation is focused upon itself, we find engineers visible to an extent found nowhere else in the world. Why is this the case? How can we understand it? What is unique about the relationship between French engineers and the French nation state? Our guiding questions in engineering cultures modules include, what does it mean to be an engineer in a given country? What counts as engineering knowledge? Where do engineers work and what's involved in that work? Our approach to answering these questions involves first identifying and describing the evolution of key cultural images in the country in question. We examine the challenges and expectations that these images pose to people who get called engineers. And then to follow engineers who have to deal with these challenges and expectations in order to make visible key patterns in their lives and in their practices. We recognize, of course, that life histories are unique as different people confront different configurations of challenges. Enabling you to identify and understand patterns is designed to help you both develop informed expectations of your own and, and an ability to sort out exceptional or unique life trajectories in the people that you meet 